It was in Wittenberg, in northeast Germany, that in October 1517 a former monk named Martin Luther nailed a document on a church door which launched the movement which became the Reformation. The document, entitled the 95 Theses, questioned the legitimacy of Catholic dogma, the absolute authority of the Pope, and especially attacked the validity of pardons issued by the Catholic Church. At that time, if a person wanted to be forgiven for their sins, they could buy an official church document called a pardon. It gave absolution to the buyer for all previously committed sins. Agents commissioned by the church, very often monks, sold the pardons and put the money they received in special collection boxes like this one. The more pardons a monk sold, the more he was respected. Luther denounced this practice as bribery, which corrupted people's souls and did not guarantee true repentance. He left his order and married. He and his wife had six children. In order to break the Catholic Church's monopoly on power and knowledge, he decided to translate the Bible into German. Until that time, all Bibles were written only in Latin making it impossible for the majority of people to read them. By translating the Bible, Luther wanted ordinary people to be able to read it without the interference and interpretations of priests. The German version was published in 1534. He also composed several hymns which were collected together and printed. Pope Leo X excommunicated Luther for these acts of defiance, but the Reformation continued, and the creation of the Protestant Church began. Luther eventually moved to Eiselben and died there quietly, in his own bed, at the age of 62. His statue still stands in the center of Wittenberg. <laughs>